Yep, turns out not out yet. No, not yet. Uh, and we are here at Top Tier Tuesdays, number 26. So um, right now we have Jimbo Slice and Good Sir, all of them. Good uh, Sir. Yeah, Chrome versus Lucina, family kill. Family kill. Dude, look at Jumbo. He looks so good. So is Earl. But anyways, <laughs> yeah. back to the match. Uh, see, this is... They're like on and off. I think they're even. Okay. Regardless, their matches are super exciting. So let's see. Oh. Yeah, Earl. Yeah, you, you just need to get away from that ledge. Especially when you need to be uh, controlling the stage. Both of them can, can control the stage really well, but not off stage. Well, what's great but about once Oh, you were saying? I'm sorry. Yeah, but once they, but once the other pillar is off stage, a very good edge guard from both of them could just. No, Jimbo's edge guarding is amazing. I mean, both of these players, like, it's crazy to think that you know. I mean, it's one of them. It makes sense, but mm -hmm. they're both really good. See, just like that. Uh, let's go, with Jimbo. <laughs> oh my gosh. No, but regardless, uh, Earl Rum still is playing really good. Um, I, I still don't count him out. He is. One, he, he's an emotional player. If he feels like he's not gonna do well the next game, if not this one, he's gonna like. Oh, he's trying to go for like a, a hard re forward smash. Ooh. Oh, out of range. Yeah. It's actually crazy. Uh, Jimbo used to get edge guarded by Usuna so well before, so I think he definitely adapted. There's been a lot of times where I see um, a lot of characters using like nares in, into uh, one of the fast in some of their fastest smash attacks, mm -hmm. such as Lucina's uh, nair to down smash. Well, I, I, know. Guess, I guess that makes sense, you know, mm -hmm. objectively. Yeah, and Zero um, also used the one for Mario, too. Mm -hmm. uh, like, late nair, to, late nair to down smash, actually, yeah. is really good. Right. Also, what you saw there, I mean, he had no other uh, option, which is why I still think Earl can bring this back. As soon as you get Jumbo, or at least Chrome off stage, I suppose Jumbo, uh, it's very hard for him to get back. That goes for either of them, but Chrome has... Chrome. Chrome, Chrome. has a... <laughs> Google Chrome. Krom has a, a worse time getting back on stage, so I definitely commend Jimbo for uh, making it back really easily. Okay, what was that? Just trying to break out of a combo by using counter? You know what? I didn't expect it, so maybe that's what his thought process was. Oh, oh my, my gosh. gosh! I saw that coming. Oh, I didn't think it was going to happen, but it happened. <laughs> so Jimbo with a confident game one. He, only won he, he lost one stock. Yeah. It was a good edge guard, but at game one going to Jimbo, um, what I think... Earl should try to focus on is pressuring him off stage. Uh, I know he only took one stock off stage, but like I know if he just pressures Jimbo off stage enough times, he's just gonna run out of options. And yeah. But Jimbo's doing a great job just slowing the pace down. He keeps pushing um, Earl off stage and controlling the. Pace oh no, Crom Dittos. Crom. Oh oh my God! What? Okay, Lucina and Crom look a little similar, but I'm sorry, <laughs> but you know what? She takes after her dad, bro. <laughs> Over here, all right. So Jimbo, of course, being the what oh, I think. Please don't do that again. Man, the colors are so similar. I'm, I'm just colorblind. Oh, please, please, <laughs> please tell me you're not uh, on rival tournaments blind. Oh my God, do not go there. Oh, oh my, oh okay. Oh, I thought man. you made it back. I'm like, oh, there's no way to make that back. Yeah, that was an unfortunate directional air dodge. I wonder why he. I mean, it's working for him. But maybe Jimbo got shook, and he's like, you know what, I, I can't can't come back to stage and he has deed. Mind games from Earl switching to Chrome. <laughs> yeah. Um, but I can but I can tell them apart. Uh, the Chrome that Earl is using is purple. It's just the tint that's very hard to see. Yeah, but I mean you can take a look at their name tags. Yeah. Uh, if you want to know Earl is sleepy. No, but both these players still super focused and Jimbo, see? I would imagine Jimbo to kind of be playing a little... Oh, oh my gosh, goes all the way up there. Wow. Let's yeah, Jim, I, I think it's even. Yeah. I think it's just even just like I that. I think Jimbo Slice knows more about um, Chrome's recovery. That's how he can do that uh, down air very well. Well, he knew exactly what option he would have gotten, so he knew how to cover that. Oh my gosh. That's threatening because well, with Lucina, you can just counter. Does Chrome have a counter? Um, All except Robin. Ah, okay. Poor Robin. <laughs> And she's still too. But we're talking about crum, 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 crum. Oh, can we not go? Can we please not go back to the lonely thing that is Fire I love Fire Emblem. It's such a great franchise. Man, but Jimbo over here taking a beating with yeah, his actually. own. Man, that's kind of a mentally. Like, uh, he picked my character and he's kind of. He took the game. Just imagine that. Uh, yeah, that's it. Probably he's after this. Back. Nope. He has a second jump. Oh, oh okay. man. He's even Earl wants boxes. to do it too. Well, I was thinking, Earl had a stock lead, so I actually expected him to pressure off stage way more, even if that cost him stock, uh, especially this round. Yeah. 
Oh, going They're for both it again. going for the same thing. Oh, uh, but this is really yeah. deadly. Yep. Um, I see 123 to zero, but still even to me. I was the air dodge. I, w I would have died. Yeah. <laughs> but right now, Jimbo Rack really needs a miracle, and this could be it. Oh man. Man, this is scary. Could, yep. Oh, is that it? Yeah. Definitely. Yep. There's no way. He come, even if he didn't like die off the blast zone, there, he couldn't have recovered. Oh man, Jim, Jim shaking his hand wide that he had the directional air dodge to the bottom. And so one one. Do you think uh, Earl of Elm's gonna stay? Probably. I mean, is this uh, um, what, uh, what, what round is this? Oh, I believe this is semis. Regardless, I believe it's best of five. If so not this semis, is one. So is this losers? Oh wait, is this no, winners? We're, we're still winners. Definitely okay, winners, so game yeah. five, he could be he could be switching characters. You know what? Because the a best of five, I actually think that's the reason why Earl decided to change. If it was a best of three, I think he would have stuck with Lucina. Mm -hmm. All right, yeah, more of the Chrome Dittos. Hold on, what's up? Oh, you know, I mean, I'm busy. You can handle, you can do it if you want. But I can't handle it now. If you press the button, press the button, that's what it is. Alright, right. sorry about Going that, guys. Back. <laughs> we back. Uh, so one one, Jimbo versus Earl. And if you're just watching now, you would think that Earl is using Lucina, or he would be, but he actually took the game with Chrome. So it works. He's sticking with it. Hey, oh my God, Dash oh reached my what? God. And Jimbo striking back, saying, "Listen, I know you can pick my character, but good use of the super armor with the soaring slash." Was that is that why you go through? Because he has super armor. Yes, uh -huh. um, just like Ike's in there. They're, but they're unlike, all like strong, bro. Yeah. But unlike Ike's Ether, it has a starting hitbox. Like, a very good starting hitbox. I think it's a really good move. I've gotten uh, destroyed by Jimbo by that move. Oh, Miss faces it. I, you know, I, I have a. You know, I think I have a question. What is it? Um, what is. Who is the. Who is like the main character of Fire Emblem Awakening? Awakening? Yeah. Uh, I have I only played like the first two Fire Emblems, so anything after that, anything DS related, I don't know anything about. Um, they all seem the, the same to me. Aren't they all like Marth's clone or something? Well, I mean, here's the thing. I mean, if it's true that Krom is actually the main character, I think I know why they actually had to use uh, the main Fire Emblem theme for uh, for Krom instead of the instead of the Awakening theme. Why is that? Exactly. Because I'm if still not Marth following. Um, with the exception of Corrin, Marth and Ike are um, the main characters of... I forgot what Marth is for Fire Emblem, but a Path of Radiance and Radiant Dawn, Ike was the main character. And one of the main characters in this match? Oh man, I was going to say Earl, but... <laughs> yeah, yeah. <laughs> I was going to say Jimbo, but Earl actually took that stock, so he has the lead. I really think... Oh, okay. Again? one one zero zero. Alright, five minutes. I... It's even. I think it's even. Uh, I love my, you know, my Jimbo, but uh, <laughs> Earl just... He always loved Jimbo. Yeah. He, yeah, again, Earl was trying to go for that counter breaker. It's just not going to happen. Especially when Krom has a, has actually has a much, uh, has a little bit longer start compared to Lucina and Marth. Well, it didn't work the first time. Oh, that, that reach! Oh, wow. Dude, Jimbo with the moves. 20%. I, I think he, uh, he's comfortable now. I think... Game two, kind of got a little shook, <laughs> but he's like, I, he's taking control very, um, very easily. I would say. Yeah. Um, very good control of the stage, especially. I've never, at least in this game, I haven't seen Oro play anybody who isn't a Fire Emblem character. Actually, no, he's played Ken. I have seen him play Ken, but. Uh, Wait, you have not seen? No crash game. You have not seen Oro play Cloud. I right? can't. I'm commentating, so I can't run it. If you can. Oh, I can add my nah, fine. Are you gonna do redemption? Oh, well, he didn't enter, so he can't. That's true. Oh, oh please, no. Oh, sorry, Crash Gear. Thank you, though. Thank you. Right. Anyways, oh. Town City's gonna be the next Dude, one. Dude, I keep forgetting Meister's here. He's right in front of me, and he has the. You know, you know what his face looks like. He has the Meister face. Meister. Meister. Smile. Oh my God, he has food in his mouth. He doesn't want to smile. Ha <laughs> ha. Got him. Ca caught him lacking. Hey! <laughs> oh, okay. Um, right. Oh, so he just switched back to Lucina. Yeah, switched to Lucina. Uh, I think it's fair. 
he lost. I mean, he won game uh, game two with it with Crumb, so that made sense. But after losing game three, uh, I was actually gonna be shocked if he stayed. Oh my gosh, falling up there. That connects so well. Mm -hmm. Yeah, but he was supposed to be like a falling up air and then falling through the platform up air. Very good conversion from Jimbo. See, so now Earl up. Oh, oh no! Just like that. Nah, he's still, he's still alive. Oh, what? I... I think I think Jimbo was a little bit too scared that he yeah. might get hit by the counter. We all kind of had that stare uh, here in the crowd, but um... Man, so Earl already taking the lead. And that was a good lead too. But like I said, you just have to pressure him off stage and just force him. Oh man. Fading out the air dodge, or at least maybe just trying to poke on the, the shield. Okay, he does not want to challenge that forward smash. See, so right now, man, Jumbo just gave up stage control. Like he had him cornered. Oh, oh my gosh. These, these footsies work, man. That was a slick roll. And at this point, uh, yeah, Earl's. Just, yeah. He almost lapped him. Yeah. But Earl's still doing good, comfortable. But you know, none of these players want to lose a single stock. They just want to dominate right now. Okay, very good, very good use of the Soric Slash. Wants really good. He just wants a fast attack. Just to give some really good damage. Twenty six percent too. I think it's a really good option. Uh, I haven't really seen a lot of people just up being at least you know center stage, but just to uh, push you off. Yeah. I mean, have you, I mean, you've seen a lot of uh, cloud climb hazards or ice ether. Bro, but speaking of pushing people out. Oh, just. I'm so good at edge guarding. It just. I hate it because I wish I was that good. <laughs> Don't worry. It will come soon enough. Soon enough. After I pay him. To, to no, pay after him. you beat Meister. Meister, oh god. Here to beat me in bracket. I'm not going to talk about that. Go for it again, then. <laughs> <laughs> I'm sorry. Alright. Yeah, do you think he's going to go to game 5? Because. I don't see my Please, no! You okay. don't do that! Man, alright, I want to apologize to my player. I, I think I cursed him, is that it? Yeah. As I stare at him, uh, the holy spirits of the commentator curses flowing out of him. So, I definitely did curse him, I apologize. But we are going to a game 5 now, so... Lucina, Krom, are they staying? Um, just seeing the facts of how they, act, um, how they played, I think Earl will stay Lucina. Jimbo really only has a bow. I think. So, uh, I don't see either of them changing stage-wise, though. They're very okay with just... I've seen them go to Pokemon a lot. Mm -hmm. I personally wouldn't mind just going to that stage. At least Wait, this is Pokemon Stadium 2. Is it a counterpick? No, it's Pokemon Stadium 1. But well, they chose illegally. Yeah, they chose it. But, yeah. but it's fine. Okay, so no character switch. No character switch, as expected. Now we're gonna jump into it. Dude, look at these players. Looking good. Look at Chicago, bro. Right. So in our semis here, we have Jimbo versus Earl, game five. Earl, taking the first hit. 30% all the ready on the board just just for that single soaring slash, too. It was like an air, like an up B, I think, which is great. Oh, this is not Dude, a place where you want to be, as you've seen it. pushing him off. You want to get away from that. Just find a just find a good way. Oh boy. If it would have hold on a little bit longer, that would have been death. Definitely. And Earl can't even get in. Uh Jumbo's just racking up all this damage. If he doesn't, if he doesn't get the kill, he's still at a comfortable comfortable spot where he's making Earl come to him. Oh, oh wow, I'm actually surprised he wasn't able to grab. Uh have to look at that later, but also face back too. Especially where Halucina lands. Oh okay. Uh, really Deep edge guard. See, Krom edge guarding. People don't expect that, and I think that's another reason why he's definitely one of the best characters. Yeah, I mean you have Gan I mean you have Gandorf in Smash Four, and Smash Four Gandorf is act is actually considered to be one of the better edge guarders. A good perfect shield, just getting that little jab. And even though Jimbo did take the first stock, he has to start backing up more percents. What? Okay, thank goodness he had his second jump. Yeah, that would have that would have been a really bad. Hit. The recovery from Jimbo was insane. Movement I wouldn't even think of. Oh, okay. I think he's trying to delay it. But he was too late. Dash attack, only gonna get him to come off stage. I mean, Jimbo really only doing 52%. Uh, I think if he gets to 80, he's at a comfortable spot where he just has to. Using the full range of the forward tilt. 
So at this point, I like to believe that the game is still even. 52% uh, is not a lot, you know, good string, and especially a good edge guard can definitely even, if not put the favor in Earl's uh, court. Ooh, good use of using the, uh, the second, uh, using the top platform, so he doesn't get punished. Well, parry for days. Don't roll that much now. See, last minute it was just Jimbo taking control of the stage, and now Earl's not letting him, he's not letting him get back to stage. Not yeah. Play the game. These sort of characters are always known to have very good stage control. And once, and once then, better edge guarding too. The walk, he he, see, the walking was broken in this game. You couldn't like react and have so many good options. That's why they're in one Yeah. Stage. I don't think I was gonna make it back. Edge guard. Ah, nice roll. Just roll. Just roll. Just just think of anything else. You can't do counters anymore. Except when he tries to edge guard. Well, what I like is that Earl, he doesn't really always want to jump on stage and hit um, Jimbo. He either does that just um, to push him off and have Jimbo stunner. Oh, no. That was a good dash attack. Yeah. Good punish. It was a good punish. Yeah. But, uh, for Earl. As I was yeah. saying, um, Earl of M, he, uh... Oh, oh. But no, he's not dead wait, yet. Wait, wait, is he dead now? Edge guard? No. He goes too slow on it. He didn't react fast enough. Yeah, I think I think Earl was a little unfaced when he saw the sparks. Those sparks, man. Uh, yeah, it's the sparks and the uh, and the finish. I, I think it's called. Uh... Oh boy. Yeah, easy. No man. That's up. I do not want to see that. But over here, All right, Jimbo's still on stage. Man, I, I really hope none of them just go off stage. Yeah. Both of them are so good. I don't care what percent we're at. Both of them are in co -percent. Okay, good use of the perfect shield on the first one. I mean, the second one, sorry. Man, why is it called Flare Blade? I have no idea why. Kimball doing a good job of just holding down his percent. Uh, three minutes left on the clock, and he is sitting comfortable even after that SD, so... I always love Jimbo using the reverse aerial rush back here. Trying to use full range, too. He's trying to go... He was, he was actually trying to search for it. And Perry. Yeah, pairing the first uh, pairing the first hit of dance is not going to do much good. Oh, but there it is. Let's go, Jimbo. Uh, that's, that's a great set, honestly. Um, Earl of M. Let's go, let's go Jimbo. So, 